Why am I having a breakdown right now? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Juliana. If you are new here, I am a third year law student in New York. And if you're not new here, welcome back my friends. It's like midday on Wednesday. I'm trying to get my shit together. Yesterday I wanted to start vlogging, but it was just a complete wash of a day. Anxiety is just in full force and my sleep was horrible on Monday night. So yesterday I like did nothing. Today I really need to get my shit together. So I spent the whole like morning doing my taxes and I finished that then I had class at 11 finished class at like 12 30 and then I was just answering back emails because I've been going back and forth with different caterers and vendors for my grad party <laughs> so I'm really excited to share the next few weeks with you guys well next couple of months actually because it's gonna be fun and it will take place outside of my apartment which most of the time my vlogs do not <laughs> next week i am doing my graduation photo shoot and my jimmy choos are coming today so we'll do a little unboxing and i still haven't picked out a dress so we have to do that and I'm really excited to do this. I've been wanting to do a graduation photo shoot for so long when I never did one for undergrad. So we about to go in for the law school graduation. I am the most extra person in the world and you best believe that my entire graduation situation is gonna be extra AF. So buckle your seatbelts, ladies and gents. Let's go into my desk and see what we got to do today. I have a class today at 4.30 and it's 1.24 right now. So I have plenty of time to actually be productive, which is nice. Basically what I have on the agenda today is MBE quiz of 10 questions. And then I'm going to carry on with outlining because I mean, really outlining doesn't end until the material ends. Cue the time lapse. <laughs> I got distracted probably within the first 40 minutes of me sitting down because I have to register for the bar exam tomorrow. Actually at midnight, the application opens. I don't know if I'm awake, then I will do it then. If not, I'll do it in the morning, but that's exciting and going to cost me 200 and something dollars woohoo and then i got an email back from one of the caterers that i'm inquiring about they're going to give me food bar staff the whole shebang which i think is pretty nice because i don't want to have to worry about anything really on that day even though like it's gonna probably cost me a good amount of money but whatever i only graduated law school once so it's fine i'm throwing a bang so According to my notifications, my Jimmy Choo's are here. <laughs> so excited. <laughs> my feet are huge, so this is kind of risky ordering these without trying them on at the store. But I like to live life on the edge, you know? And to be honest, if they don't fit, then I don't even think that they have a bigger size. So um, uh, I'll just cry and that will be it. Okay. 
Let's open. I am obsessed. These are absolutely stunning. Like, I, I don't even think I could put these on my feet. Like, they don't deserve to be down there. Like, they deserve to be on a pedestal. All right, but now for the moment of truth. Do they fit my feet? Are Cinderella's slippers going to fit today? I'm nervous. I've never had designer shoes, by the way. Oh, it fits. <laughs> I'm really happy that these fit. Oh my god. We are registered for the bar exam. Yeah. <laughs> so many feelings, so many emotions. Holy moly. So I printed out my application confirmation. Although you don't need to, but I do recommend you printing out confirmation of you registering for the bar exam. Also, confirmation and results of your passing. New York law exam score if you are taking the bar in New York and printing out confirmation of your passing NPRE score if you are taking the bar in a jurisdiction that requires a passing NPRE which the majority of jurisdictions do. I don't know off the top of my head which state doesn't require that but it's pretty much every single state. The MPRE scores are unavailable after a certain amount of time, so you do need to print it out so you have that verification that you pass. Same thing with the New York law exam. The score is only available and valid until 2024, which is fine because as long as you <laughs> take the bar and are admitted to the bar before 2024, then you don't need to retake the New York law exam. It's just a one-time only situation. What is on the agenda? the main focus was to register for the bar exam and that didn't really take too long <laughs> so let me pull up my notion and see what i have scheduled for today i don't have any class so we are pretty much free to do whatever we want got my law school dashboard i'm going to scroll down let's see all right, so yesterday I skipped outlining because as I said, maybe I didn't say this, but after I got my Jimmy Choo's, nothing productive happened. And that's why I didn't vlog after I opened my Jimmy Choo's. <laughs> so I have a lot of outlining to do. I am going to probably 10 MBE questions from my Kaplan quiz bank because I need to do 300 questions to sit for the final and right now I have it scheduled so I do about 10 a day and then I have two practice exams that I'm going to do to prepare for the final so that's why I'm only doing 10 because I don't want to use up all the questions that they have in the test bank and I want to be able to take the 50 question practice exam that I have scheduled and the 100 question practice exam with fresh questions that I've never used before. And then I also have to do a 15 question MBE practice quiz on my famous bar prep portal. So that's completely different from the Kaplan 10 questions. So we have a total of 25 MBE practice questions that we are going to do today. And then I need to outline for conflicts of law and secure transactions. So... <sighs> Oh shit. Oh no, I know. <sighs> Why am I having a breakdown right now? <laughs> well, 
I just realized that it's Easter this weekend and Sunday is going to be a wash. That means I'm not going to do any homework or anything. And I basically do any, everything that I was supposed to do on Sunday, push it all now. <sighs> okay. Let me rearrange things. Um, and see what's going on with my schedule because I'm pretty sure I'm going to have to actually add on a reading for secure transactions today. So I think that's probably what I'll do. All right. So yeah, we're going to do that. We're going to do 25 MBE questions. We're going to outline and we're going to read for class on Monday. All right. Ready, set, go. Yeah. Go team. <laughs> out I can't seem to focus right now and I need to read so I decided let me take a break because it's five o'clock and I have been sitting at my desk for like two hours I know I have a package so why don't we go outside just get some fresh air because it's been a hot minute since I've actually been outside. Well, I went outside yesterday to get my shoes. So that's really the extent of me like going outside is just to go get packages, which is sad. It's kind of cold. So the thing is my package is either gonna be there or it's not because my neighbor brought it in. So I guess we'll see. It's there and it's nothing exciting. It's just Amazon stuff. It's actually, well, it could be exciting. I can make anything exciting. But the main thing that I got was the bags for my Roomba because it empties itself. And the other day it was full. And then I also got, oh, it's so nice out. I'm just gonna stand here. I also got vitamins because I wanna start taking them to prepare for the bar exam because I heard that vitamins are good for you. No shit. But I got vitamin B12 and vitamin D because obviously I'm lacking vitamin D since I'm in the house all the time. Right now I'm trying to get my vitamin D as I stand here. Okay. I'm trying to think if I got anything else. I think it was just, okay. Oh, I did. Guys. Highlighters, what's up? Y'all know we love a good good highlighting set. Maybe I'll take the vitamin B12 right now because I got a vitamin D3 and B12, extra strength, energy, metabolism support. I'm going to take some right now and see if it helps me focus because that's the whole point of me buying it. And I will let you know how it goes. Ooh. Okay, I'm done for the day. That avocado toast was so good. I am a chef, if you didn't know. 
it's 7.51 and stage 19 is going to start soon. So I will watch that and then I will see you guys at 9 for SVU. Yeah. Three heinous in New York City. The dedicated detectives who investigate these vicious felonies are members of an elite squad known as the Special Victims Unit. These are their stories. Dun dun. I'm thriving. I'm absolutely thriving right now. My hair is not, but like, internally, I am thriving. super puffy i took it out of a braid and it's just whoo okay lion me i folded laundry did my toenails put on the roomba which you could probably hear right now and did the dishes and just kind of cleaned up this morning now it's 12 25 and i haven't done anything school related yet i am going to finish my reading that I was supposed to finish yesterday and didn't <laughs> because I have so much to do I did time block out my day so then once I finish the reading I'm going to jump into my conflicts of law lecture do that quiz and then I believe Matt and I are going out to dinner later so on top of that I have to make sure I'm ready to go eat all right, let's jump into the work we have to do today and cue the time lapse. <laughs> time lapse so it's about 3 15 right now and i still have an hour lecture oh shoot that's only part one so probably about two hours of a lecture to watch and then a quiz to take i'll take notes as i watch the lecture and then i still have to do some mbe problems so i Told Matt, I really just don't think I'll be able to go out to dinner tonight because I just feel like with Easter on Sunday I have way too much to do in the next two days. So no, it's fine. I'll go to the grocery store. Did really you make so. a reservation? No, they weren't. They didn't accept any. Oh, okay. So I feel bad. I just like I sometimes you gotta make sacrifices in law school. And it's going to be over soon. I got to okay, keep it going. I'll talk to you guys after. <laughs> Just finished eating, made myself a fancy, as you can see, it's all over my shirt made myself a fancy avocado grilled cheese and now i'm catching up on gray's anatomy and i'm gonna watch the second part of svu aka well the second part of svu slash organized crime and i have to watch a million little things so like i have a lot of tv ahead of me so i really can't do my homework right now um yeah sorry <laughs> actually like finished all that i'm gonna do for the day anyway if you feel like you're burnt out just stop because right now i don't need to push myself so hard but i will probably at the end of like next weekend and the next weekend I'm gonna have to go hard, so 
I'm gonna take it a little bit easier today and then I'll wake up somewhat early-ish ish tomorrow and get back to it <laughs> so I guess uh see you guys tomorrow Happy Saturday. Oh, matches. Matt just went out. I think he's home with my Duncan. That's literally the only reason why I'm getting out of bed right now. Sunday. Happy Easter. I didn't really vlog yesterday. I basically sat at my desk the entire day doing work and I just didn't feel like getting up to do time lapse and whatnot. So you guys have seen basically my Saturday routine anyway. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I hope that it is motivating you to be productive this week and kicking off finals season we're gonna be going hard this coming week so next week's vlog get ready for all the productivity my final study schedule and we'll just get into the nitty-gritty of law school finals and my last law school finals ever can't wait all right love you guys have a good week mm -hmm.